Drought conditions continue to worsen across Oklahoma. At the same time, hot days and cold nights are making a bad situation worse for the wheat crop. Jimmy Music is president of the National Association of Wheat Growers. Our crops are really hurting because of drought. And, and what, we had some freeze damage the other night. And obviously at this point in time, no one knows just exactly how that's going to play out. But, but it got pretty low in the low 20s here for a number of hours, not just a, a, a few hours, but a number of hours. And we're, we're concerned our wheat, that the, our best looking wheat is the wheat that we think got hurt the most in, in the freeze, with the freeze damage. So we're very concerned about it. I think the acres are going to be less than what was projected, and I think the yield is going to be less than what was projected. In fact, Music says a close visual inspection shows the top four to six inches of the soil dry, although there is a bit of subsoil moisture, no aphids, green bugs, or disease, no supplemental top dressing either. Music says the lack of rainfall doesn't justify the added cost. The plant is tillered uh, pretty decently for this dry weather. The problem is, is the size of that head is going to be uh, way smaller than than normal okay. and obviously we we hope that head as it emerges doesn't come out white and, and hollow. Jimmy Music, president of the National Association of Wheat Growers. Reporting for the Oklahoma Wheat Commission and Oklahoma Genetics Incorporated, I'm Don Atkinson.